on. Titus here with real breaks. Ready for our first Bowman Chrome of the night. Going to have somebody pick top or bottom for us. Uh, we still have a couple spots left in that last break of the night. The uh, Bowman Mixer number two. Let's see. We had four left last I checked. Jeff just grabbed a spot. Thank you, Jeff. I'll copy that over. Get them on the list. So we got three left. And we still need payments from a couple people. Comment real quick. Gotta get these, gotta get these payments in, um, so that I can random this after this break. Otherwise, we're not gonna have much time to trade. Jamie, and Ryan. All right, three left. Let's get that thing filled. What's it gonna be, top or bottom? I'm excited for this one. Jackpot reset. But uh, probably won't take too long to get back up. Brian does a couple more five case random player breaks. What's it gonna be, top or bottom? Come on, somebody's brave. Thomas did a great job picking the last one. A beautiful Eloy, Eloy uh, nugget of a gold label. Come on, do you need do you mean to put them side by side so we can go left or right? Yeah, I'll give you the 360. Bottom. Thanks, Bullet. Bullet just had to see what it looked like on the side. Or on the on the end. You know, beautiful, beautiful case of Bowman Chrome right here. Let's get rolling. So I have one more, one more case of Bowman Chrome that will break tonight. And then that Bowman mixer will wrap us up at midnight. Not today, Bullet. Not today. This one's going to be awesome. Because I'm breaking it. Let's pull some big cards. Send everyone home happy. Let's see, let me get my team list back up here. Well, it's got two brewers in this one. Anything else? Just the brewers, it looks like. Get me wrong, gold labels was a lot of fun, but I love ripping this Bowman stuff. Monsters lurking in here.
Well, I went back and I was rewatching. I can't remember. I think it was the one that I hit the Hyera in. So we hit a Hyera Arizona Fall Legato. We hit a. Uh, who was it for the Cubs? Was it Ian Happ? I think it was Ian Happ, AFL alumni auto. And we hit. Let's see, what was the other one? There's th three insert autos. There's another. Oh, yeah, it was a Nico. Nico Horner, I think gold patch auto. Three answered autos over the same case. Kyle, what's going on, man? Thanks for coming to hang out. Box number one, here we go. And we're off. Kloffenstein refractor auto for the Blue Jays. Blue Jays to Nathan Hess. Purple Shimmer, Jeffrey Del Rosario. Green Refractor, De Young, out of 99. Cardinals to Dylan Miller. Yeah, bullet. Let's keep it going. Michael King, Yankees auto. Bullet, what do you still need for it? The super? Yankees going to Sean Beiswinger. Purple Shimmer, Jesus Sanchez for the Rays. Blue Refractor, Alec Baum. Yeah, two grand is a little steep on that one. Ah, Kyle, I hated to see that. Ugh. Yeah, I was saying earlier tonight, it'll be interesting to see what it does to not just his prices, but the prices of, uh, you know, of his suit, or uh, of just of his cards and his autos. Um, but then the rest of the products in, in general. Like, it'll be interesting to see how these releases do now that he's on the, on the injured list. Ryan thinks he's going to be the next Greg Odin. Hopefully not. For the sake of myself as a basketball fan and the sake of the hobby. Non-auto, atomic, orange, and super. Let's see if we can at least knock that atomic out bullet. That's not too much to ask for. Yeah, six to eight weeks is going to be tough. talking bad about my boy D Rose Jamie D Rose was amazing for the Wolves last year out of nowhere one of the best free agent signings of the year Number two. Brian Rocio, Indians auto. Eight 
Indians to Sean Beisinger. Yeah, Bullet, we'll get it for you. Gorman Refractor. That one's not too hard to hit. Been hitting one or two Atomic in every case. Cam Rogner Brewers Auto. Going for you, Bullet. Purple, Israel Pineda for the Nationals. Soto Refractor out of four ninety nine. Still early, Nathan. We're just two boxes in. Jamie, did you see that Eloy in the last in the in the gold label case that we just did? Amazing. Let's see if we can get some Eloy color though. Base the big streak down the middle of it. Hopefully that comes off. It's a printer mark or what? Jamie, the the nugget. Nugget was not autographed. I think it was a was a relic underneath it though, a piece of jersey. There we go. Nathan, you asked for us to heat it up. I'll heat it up. Purple Perdomo. Boom Poodle for Jeremy Babb. Almost tipped over the mitt. There we go. Purple Logan Gilbert. That'll get it going too. Luis Garcia auto for the Phillies. I would have been happy if I bought that, bought that box. Philly's going to Brian Lay. Nice, Jeremy. Send him off to BGS. How about that? <laughs> Gonna get you the rainbow. Boom, Perdomo, Purple Shimmer. Acuna Purple out of 250. Man, what a box. Anything else out of here? 
So there's that T-Bot. Yeah, I think you can see it on the screen there. Some kind of scuff. Hopefully it comes off. And then a Peralta refractor out of 499. Top of this Acuna as well. Jeremy, hashtag Team Titus. Oh, Kyle. <laughs> I don't know, man. I mean, he wasn't the only problem with the Phillies this year, but. Got to feel good for the Nationals to, you know, to have them leave and then still show that they're capable of that. But hopefully Harper's not too hard on himself. Did a lot of good for that team. I think he's probably sitting somewhere on a beach counting his money, so I don't think he's too worried. It'll be all right. You're in Memphis, right? Have you read some of the crazy stories about uh, D. Rose's diet while he was in college? <laughs> when they were in the, the NCAA uh, tournament, I read a story that he like missed like a media session because he had such a bad stomach ache because he was just eating, you know, candy. I think, I think the quote was he eats like Twizzlers for breakfast and M&Ms for lunch or something. <laughs> this nuts. Poor guy. But he just, just had a sugar addiction. I, I think he's kicked that now, but <laughs> definitely it doesn't help when you're injury prone. I mean, it helps cause it. Doesn't help you avoid injuries when you're doing that. <laughs> yeah, Sour Patch Kids. I mean, I'm not hating on Sour Patch Kids, but can't have them for breakfast and lunch. Eli White Auto Rangers. Yeah, he's definitely a special player. Rangers to Kevin McGee. Jeez. What do you think, Jeremy? What's next? Which Perdomo are we going to hit next? Perdomo Refractor. If you guessed base, you're right, because there was a base in there. Kyle Tucker Refractor out of 499. Salmito so Augustin, the guy that has two different first Bowman autos. He had, he had the first Bowman denotation on, in 2019 Bowman. Nats to Kevin Thompson. Green Shimmer Genesis Cabrera out of 99. AFL alumni Bellinger. Good looking card. I think those are, are those one per case? Nothing better than cracking a fresh pack of pennies. Like Cabrera for the Cardinals and Dylan. 
Two greens, both to the Cardinals so far. All right, four boxes in, eight to go. Kyle, they always find a way to mess mess a couple things up. Didn't uh, I'm pretty sure Casey Mize's uh, uh, Mega Box parallel, the Mojo one, says first Bowman too. We all know that. <laughs> He had plenty of Bowman cards last year. Nathan, I'm sure we'll get you some. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it in a Elvis. I think you'd be fine if you just got one or Elvis. Let's see what we can do. John says last one is Clint or is uh, full. Let me go and make sure. I saw it. Right as I started, I saw Jamie said that he had claimed a spot and then deleted his post. So there might be one more spot available than than previously thought. Nathan, there was a gold hiding in this pile here. Let's see if there's ink on it. All right, give me just a second. Let's count on that last. Okay, so Jeff said two more, and then John said one. But if Jamie deleted his, then there should be one more still. Oh, if, if there's a spot, I'll still take one. Okay, perfect. So look, here, let me comment real quick. And let's get this all paid so that I can random it right after this. And Facebook's being weird though. Like when I go back, it uh, it's putting the comments in a weird order for me. I'm trying to find. Let's see, there's Jeff. All right, sounds good. So we're all full there. And uh, yeah, let's get those payments in. Just had a couple people left that needed to pay, and then I'll run that random right after this. Uh, John, we still have one more Bowman Chrome before then. So this is number 83. We got 84 going right after this. And then we'll have that mix here at midnight. Blue, Francisco Morales. Danny Diaz, Red Sox Auto. Red Sox to Ben Forcier. Kyle Ryan's just uh, just hanging out. Spencer Howard, Purple Shimmer. Um, this was supposed to be one of Tom's nights. So I think Tom's going out of town. So I got the call from the bullpen. Thanks, Jamie. Jamie, I just kept, I kept you in the original spot in the list. So where you had previously commented, uh, let me make sure. Yep, so I still got you at spot number eight. All 
Jonathan Machado refractor auto. So four ninety nine going to the Cardinals and Dylan Miller. Nice hit, Dylan. Yeah, you're good, John. You're good. Aramis Adaman gold out of fifty. Gold going to the Cubs and Sean Beisminger. Yeah, as long as all the payments in, I'll, I'll run the random right after this before we do the next one. Robinson Cano refractor out of 499 Mets. Seven boxes in. So John, are you a Nats fan? How do you think they'll do this week in the World Series? I wonder if Ryan will do any uh, contests or anything. It'd be fun to do a little giveaway and have people have people make some predictions. Uh, if you follow Money Mitts uh, on Instagram, they're doing a giveaway. Where Jimmy's giving away, uh, uh, I think a trifold, trifold mid. If you just pick the winner, and take a friend in it, so easy giveaway to enter. Go on Instagram at Money Mitts to enter that and check out some of some of Jimmy's beautiful work. He does an amazing job with all of the mitts. Houston in six says Jamie. That's kind of what I'm leaning, leaning towards. Mason Englert, Rangers auto. It'll be interesting to see how the layoff affects the Nationals because since they swept, they had plenty of time off. Sometimes that's good, sometimes it's bad. Rangers going to Kevin McGee. Kyle says Nats in seven. Couldn't Torres Costa purple shimmer. Nats in five. That's bold, Kevin. Put some money on that. A nice return. Moises Gomez Rays auto. Let's get an insert auto. I'm going to hit an insert. Raise to Brian Lay. Yon Duran, a refractor. He's the one that I hit the Black Shimmer 101 of a couple weeks ago. Image variation, Chance Adams for the Yankees. I like that card. Nice close up. Yankees to Sean Beiswinger. Long ways to go, Josh. Fit lots of canarios in the cases I've done. Could double up on them. I 
only halfway through. Lots of autos to come. Yeah, Kevin, if they're going to win it, they're going to have to win the first two, I think. I would love to have it go seven games, though, just as a baseball fan. Nothing better than game seven in the World Series. Twins didn't even make it to game four, unfortunately. It's funnier, though. I probably made it to about a dozen Twins games. Didn't take full advantage of my season tickets, but went to all the big giveaways, so worked out. Paid for my season just by going to those games. Tebow base. Israel Pineda, Nationals Auto. Nats going to Kevin Thompson. <laughs> Sorry about that, Jamie. Jeffrey Del Rosario Refractor. Yeah, there were some bad teams this year. So we got a redemption coming up here. Move it to the back. It's a rookie. Oh, for sure, Jamie. Future is bright there. Gorman, purple shimmer. Refractor, Josh Bell. All right, what do we got? Chrome Auto Relic Orange. Kevin saw Gold Alonzo last night. How about an orange Alonzo? Oh, Arias. It's not Alonzo, but that is a huge hit. Orange Arias going to the Padres and Sean Beiswinger. Boom. Kyle, so the reason that I did it this year is that the Twins did a cool program where uh, you could do like a subscription. It was 50 bucks a month for standing room only tickets to the game. So you didn't have any seats, but just to get into, get into the game is 50 bucks a month. So basically 300 bucks for the season. Um, so yeah, like I said, like we just went to all the big giveaway games and we were able to pay for, me and uh, Emil did it and we were able to pay for it just by going to those games. And typically, I mean, like, early in the year when we went, there were so many seats because it was so cold that we were sitting, like, fifth row behind first base or wherever. Um, but there was only probably one or two games we went to all year that it was so packed that we couldn't get seats. But 50 bucks a month, can't really beat that. I don't know if they'll do that again next year. I heard some other teams did that, too, but... That's a lot different being in a place like Minnesota as opposed to like New York or Boston or something where they're selling out every game. I mean, during the summer, though, the Twins sold out most games. But Plenty of good standing room spots at Target Field, too. It's actually really nice. Like, most of the way around the stadium, uh, they got, you know, they got like high top bars where you can stand and watch the games. And they have heaters right above them. 
So you can just stand underneath the heaters. So even at the beginning of the season, it's only like 45 degrees. You know, you just go and stand underneath the heater and enjoy some baseball. Yeah, Jamie, the other nice thing is uh, for getting down to the target field, there's really good public transportation to get down there. So there's actually a, a high-speed train that goes all the way into the suburbs that goes literally straight to Target Field Station. So you can just take that in. Otherwise, it's really easy to get to off the highway. But it's in a great, great spot. So you can actually ride the train to the game for free. There's an Atomic hiding back there. Maybe it's Hyera. There's a, blue, or a purple Yelich, though, for Bullet. Man, this has been the Perdomo case. Diamondbacks going to Jeremy. Perdomo number two for him in this one. I'll send you my PayPal so they can uh, send me a, send me some flowers or something. Green Rocio out of ninety nine. So it's not a high arrow, but it's a nice on India going to the Reds. Yeah, Jamie, it's really nice that they uh, do the free train for, for getting to Target Field. Makes it really easy. Tons of people do it. Even when, so me, Ryan, and, and Emil went to the went to the ALDS game at Target Field. And even then, we parked right next to the stadium, and it was 17 bucks in the ramp. Not bad at all. Levon Soto, Angels Auto for Brian Lay. Absolutely, Ryan. Yeah, for everyone that hasn't got a chance to check out Target Field, I would definitely recommend it. Nick Green, Refractor, out of 4.99. They did a really nice job with it. Blue Turner out of 150. Thanks, Jeremy. $45 for the train, Jamie. That's a little bit much. That conversion rate, it'll get you. Four more boxes. <laughs> All right, I'll stop, Jamie. Yeah, Ryan, the left field bleachers. Left field bleachers are really nice. You're right in home run territory. And most games you can get tickets there for like 20 bucks. Yeah, Jamie, I haven't been to PNC yet, but uh, my wife, one of her one of her bridesmaids, actually just got married and moved out. They live like just just like a mile from PNC, and so I think next year we're gonna try to go out there during the summer to visit them and check out that park. But I've done a lot of the East Coast stadiums, but I haven't been to PNC yet. Been to. The new Yankee Stadium, I've been to Fenway a couple times, I've been to Camden, um, I've been to Citizens Bank, uh, let's see where else have I been out there, um, 
Yeah, when I was little, we did uh, Wenzel Perez out of 499. We did kind of a road trip. We flew into, uh, I think, Boston and then drove down. Darren Vavra going to the Rockies. Rockies to Cameron Bourne. Jorge Mateo Green refractor. One of my, I gotta say one of my favorites that I've been to though is uh St. Louis. I had a chance to go there on a baseball trip and that was a really cool one there. With the museum and uh you got the arts in Sackerfield. Beautiful. A lot of history there. Jordan Yamamoto for the Marlins. Yeah, it'd be fun to get to every park, Jamie. Marlins to Jeff Yerksa. I always thought that um, it's kind of cool. Wenzel Perez, purple shimmer. So two, two Perez out of that box. Um, have you seen that? They like the scratch off posters with all the stadiums on it. So you scratch them off as you go. Trumbo orange for the, or sorry, gold for the Orioles. Out of 50. You can get it, and it's just in, in the shape of the ballpark for each field, and then you can scratch it off. It's kind of cool. Orioles to Kevin McGee. Dodger Stadium's cool, too. My dad grew up in LA, so been a been a little bit of a fan of the Dodgers for a while. He took me there. Um, on my honeymoon a couple months ago, got to do Angel Stadium, which is just okay, and then uh, Petco in San Diego, which was really fun. I enjoyed that one a lot. Petco is beautiful. What else is everyone's favorite? What do I gotta put on my list? Yeah, LA is beautiful, man. It's a lot of fun to go out there. Most of my family's moved out of there now, but still fun to visit. Used to go there a lot over like spring breaks and stuff. Dadu San Fran does not go well together. Pretty easy for me. Root for the Twins in the AL and the Dodgers in the NL. Unfortunately, neither of them can close it in the postseason. But that's all right. Can't always have it your way. Purple Cal, Cal Quantrill. Ooh, we got an orange, orange auto. Come on, Arelvis. Come on, for Nathan. Ah, that's all right. That's still a good one. Miguel Geraldo, orange out of 25. I've already hit an orange Arelvis. Would have been fun to hit a second one. Still a good one for Nathan. Anytime we can hit an orange auto, that's huge. I'm not going to knock the two Perdomos out, but we'll put it right next to here. Geraldo's still a good prospect, though. Bullet, my PC. Um, I don't collect a ton. I, I, do, a, I do collect twins. Um, but then just a couple of, couple of unique prospects that I collect. I collect one guy, Logan Shore, who's in 2018. Bowman Chrome was his first auto um, that I played against in high school. He went to... High school right down, right uh, in the neighboring city as me. 
Nick Green, Yankees auto. So he's now in double A for the Tigers. He was with the A's, um, but then he got traded in the, oh, was it Mike Fires trade? I can't remember. He got traded last year. Yankees to Sean Beisinger. And then I uh, also collect some of the prospects that I've gotten to know through my ministry. Um, Richard Gallardo, uh, one of them, Brewer Hicklin. He's our Royals. He had his first first auto in this year's Bowman. And then also a couple other guys like Evan White, um, Taryn Vavra is one of them that's in this product. But yeah, a little, little bit of everything. Not super deep into anyone. I guess I take that back. I've got, I've got like 60 Bellinger Heritage rookies from 2017. Just raw ones that I've been stocking. So I need him to end up winning MVP. Come on, let's hit something for Josh. Let's do it. Yeah, I've heard that about the White Sox Stadium. We had a chance to go when we were at the National. The Cubs were playing day games, so that was uh, that was out of the question. But we thought about doing a White Sox game. But it's like, eh. I would actually rather go to the, the Chicago Dogs Stadium. It looked sweet. We had our Beckett party right next to it, and actually the convention center is right next to it too. But the Chicago Dogs Stadium looks awesome. They're in the same league as one of the teams in St. Paul, St. Paul Saints, who have a beautiful stadium as well for the American Association, independently. Come on, I said a Noel V. Noel V for Josh. Gold Shimmer hiding out in here. Looks like it's got some ink. Is there Gold Shimmer autos? Jorge Alcala for the Twins. I don't know if there's Gold Shimmer autos or not. Blue Wahoos, yeah. Twins going to Jason Tibbetts. I love minor league stadiums. Anderson Tejada. Gold Shimmer. I know I've talked about it several times before, but the Arizona Fall League, so much fun at those minor league stadiums. I highly recommend it to people. Rangers going to Kevin McGee. Yeah, the spring training and minor league stadiums, really fun atmosphere. There are Gold Shimmer autos. Good to know. I think this this green might have some ink on it. it. Does Quentin Torres Costa out of ninety nine for bullet? We got one box left to hit something for Josh. Brewers to bullet. Let's see if we can get that up here. Boom! Love having that full showcase. Purple Shimmer Bomb. Come on, Hyera. We did it. <laughs> Called it. Let's go. We got a Posey Refractor out of 499. There you go, Bullet. No need to hit eBay. I'll top load it for you, too. Boom. Kesson Hyera Atomic for you, buddy.
Yeah, spring training is a little bit tough just because they're making so many switches. But Arizona Fall League is fun because you get to see all the top prospects from every team. And there's nobody there. You can get autographs and foul balls and whoever, whoever you want. I remember one time uh, when we were there, I picked up over the course of like five days. I think I got like a dozen broken bats from guys just because there was nobody there after the games. So nobody else to ask. And then just shipped them home. Bullet must not be around anymore. It's going to be happy when he gets that one, though. I mean, all in all, this has been a really good case. Two orange autos, one being the, the Relic Redemption, so that'll be a patch. Oh, we still need to hit something for Josh. Josh, come on. Jeffrey Del Rosario for the Royals. Come on, let's at least get a Canario or something. Royals to Jason Borges. Nick Green, purple, out of 250. All right, come on. Purple Hanniger. Devers, it's a, it's a good one. But sorry, Josh, I tried, man. We're all rooting for you. This is a big auto, though, going to Jeff to wrap us up. Get one more sand in here. Purple Shimmer, Nolan Jones. Refractor, Austin Dio out of 499. He's sleeved up and then we'll recap. I know, Josh. Hurts for me, too. Don't like to do that to anybody. I blame it on Ryan. It was Ryan's case. All right, let's shift over just a little bit so we get that whole showcase in. All right, there's the first Atomic, it was in India. A good stack of other parallels. But it wasn't, a, wasn't as important as this one. Hyura Atomic going to Bullets PC. It was the one that he needed. Perdomo Refractor out of 499. And then also a Perdomo Purple Shimmer. Acuna Purple. Chance Adams Photo Variation. Lower numbered stuff. Green Mateo out of 99. Green Rocio out of 99. Green Shimmer Cabrera out of 99. Green DeYoung out of 99. Gold Shimmer Anderson Tejada out of 50. Gold Trumbo out of 50. 
Go to Edelman out of 50. Del Rosario Royals, Alcala Twins, Green Yankees, Yamamoto Marlins, Vavra Rockies, Soto Angels, Nationals Pineda, Gomez Rays, Inglert Rangers, Diaz Red Sox, Augustin Nationals, White Rangers, Rogner Brewers, Rocio Indians, King Yankees. <laughs> And bullet, we did it for you, man. Is that the last box or second to the last box? I think Machado Refractor out of 499 Cardinals, Kloffenstein Refractor out of 499 Blue Jays. All right, showcase Devers Refractor out of 499 for the Marlins, Quentin Torres Costa Green out of 99 for the Brewers and Bullet. Luis Garcia, base auto for the Phillies and Brian Lay. Two sick oranges here. First one's a Miguel Geraldo for the Blue Jays and Nathan Hess. That's out of 25. And this monster. Chrome auto relic orange refractor parallel. Luis Arias for the Padres and Sean Beiswinger. And the co monument hits of the break along with the other parallels we hit. Two Perdomos, a purple refractor, and a base. Going to the D-backs and Jeremy Babb. That's going to wrap this one up. I'm going to tally payments on that uh, last mixer of the night. And then as long as all those in, I'll run the random. And then we'll go live with Bowman Chrome number 84. So thank you, everyone.